Yo, what's up guys? So this week there were happening a lot of different things. Beside the news that the EU and the NACE servers are finally moved under the wings of PA, we also have a bunch of things happening to us, to our progression, and let's start from the good news. We managed to get enough Kafras to get C20 Kutum. My Kutum was level 15 and to get level 20 I needed 11,748 Kafras and as you can see, I got it. And as always, C20 deserves the animation. And it's level 20, finally. Well, this is how the gear looks like now. The newly obtained C20 Kutum, C20 Libors, Ted Fallen God, C20 Griffon, and C20 Maskans. And of course, the Pan Blaster Longsword. The only gear piece that I'm missing is Pen Blaster Awakening. As you guys know, the past couple weeks We've been trying to get Pen Blaster Awakening. So far we are at 0 out of 12 and I've decided to put hold on the Pen Blaster Awakening. Why I decided to put hold on that goal? Well, mainly it's because of the events. Events, events, events. They are just raining events on us at the moment. So it's very nice opportunity to buy items like Kafras, memory fragments, accessories, and etc etc for like quite cheap prices. So my plan is to prepare a bunch of money to be ready to buy some items, some memory fragments, some accessories for cheaper than they are usually. The thing is that the 2 million cronstones are gon always gonna be there, yeah, from vendor. You always can just go and buy them and click the pen blaster thumbs. But the opportunity of all these events flooding the market with so many items and then I'll be able to buy them cheaper is like quite rare so I think I should use that one try to invest as much money as possible into some cheaper cheaper stuff and yeah the clip that is playing in the background is basically my first death after I gotten the C20 boss armors what did I get here? Well, mainly because I was doing some stupid shit. I got way too comfy with the spot and I was landing in like between the packs in the middle of the mobs and in this situation I landed right before the damage of the skill, got back attacked from the main column and got a back attack from the smaller golems and that's how I died. Hopefully this is gonna be a lesson for me and uh, I won't die anymore because well Dying at golems is quite bad. Losing elf cars. No, no, no. That's not good. And on this note, let's get into enhancing. This week we did a little bit of uh, everything, a little bit of accessory, a little bit of black star, and a little bit of pen boss cooks. Let's go! As I said, just a bit of access enhancing, 1 out of 3, quite nice result, I will take it. And as you guessed, we are clicking more Ted Blasters.
So that was 8 Ted Blackster fails, unlucky. But we did manage to reach 148 fail stack, and uh, let's see how the pen attempts went. Exclamation point pen, boys and girls, let's do this. We have 7 clicks on this one. Can we get pen below 200? Let's go. Attempt number 1. Attempt number 1. Number two. Is the pen incoming? Maybe. No. Red noses. Five red noses we have, yeah. Three. The fourth one. Okay, maybe this one. Maybe this one, guys. Last fail. Three more. I think the dream is shattering. Ooh. Ah. Last click. Hundred ninety. No. No, 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 no. Seven fails. No pen. And we get pan. Let's see. Yeah. The pen below 200. Let's go! Come on! Come on! Penurgon! Ah! Linger. And that fail. Oh, 202. Fail stack. No easy pen today, but easy 202 stack. Yep, no luck this week for pen boss armors, but we managed to get 202 fail stack. As you guys remember, we still need to make three pen accessories, pen turos, double pen domes. So we need the fail stacks. We need 250 fail stacks. We need 280 fail stacks. So maybe next week this 202 fail stack gonna become 250 stack. Who knows? We shall see. But that is it, if you enjoyed the video like and subscribe and until the next time.